Hey, Lenny Flash, 28th of November, Thanksgiving Day. And I pray you all are blessed today. I truly do. I just wanted to give a little example of what I'm grateful for. I'm grateful that God and his mercy brought me to a place in my life that forced me to reason with why the world is the way it is, why my life was going the way it was going, and watching the world just slip into darkness before I came to the knowledge of Jesus, understanding that there were dark powers at work in this world, but simply labeling them as evil, elite, you know, New World Order, Bilderbergs and whatnot, looking at them as just men trying to run our lives and destroy families and just everything we see all coming into plain view and that's what i'm thankful for i'm thankful for the truth when everything really does come to fruition and you're not in christ and you're not standing on that rock you will more than likely die for fear of what's occurring in front of you I'm just telling you because I love you. And I'm going to just play a little clip here. And I have to warn you, there are a couple of curse words in there. Our very own president, for one. And it just is an example to, to help show you that everything that's presented to you by the world and not by the Spirit through the Word of God is a lie. And at very best, has a sprinkling of truth just enough to tag you along and just pull you on to the next bigger lie. And the whole point is to have you live out your life in your sin, not even knowing that there is life eternal through Christ Jesus. And if you die in that sin, you will face judgment for that sin. And the penalty of sin is death. And Jesus paid the price. He is the only way out of the darkness. He is the light. And Satan comes as an angel of light. And this is what you're seeing through the media, through our politics, through entertainment, and on and on and on. You know, take this little montage here with a grain of salt, but also contemplate what it is you're seeing and who you truly are in Christ Jesus and seek him through his blood He's paid the price. So I pray you all have a wonderful day. Again, a warning for some of the language, but it tells a very plain, flat-out story. And I pray it blesses you. He passed away impoverished in a seedy New York hotel room. After he died, the U.S. government confiscated his possessions. Only Professor John Trump, who was with us today, did not stop there. And he has some wild ideas, but I've, a, I've checked a few of them and they stood up. They were plausible and reasonable and I began studying uh, the insulation of high voltages in vacuum and the acceleration of heavy particles to high energy. My uncle explained that to me many, many years ago, the power, and that was 35 years ago. But as time went on, things seemed to be heading in the opposite direction, a dumbing down. How did this happen? Ladies and gentlemen, the President of America! <laughs> President Camacho! Shut up! I know she's barren, but I got a solution. I got a solution. Somebody had to do it. I am the chosen one. Somebody had to do it. Plan to fix everything. I alone can fix it. He's gonna make them grow again. We will make America great again. He's gonna fix everything. I know the best people. I know guys that are so good. That's really bullshit. He's got a higher IQ than any man alive. I thought your head would be bigger. I will be the greatest president that God ever created. I tell you that. You know, I'm like a smart person. So smart! Did you my word? Continue defrauding the public with ridiculous bullshit. Believe me, folks. Believe me. Don't be a pussy.
God bless you all and your families. Peace and grace to you. Many fish. Finally, my brethren, be strong in the Lord and in the power of his might. Put on the whole armor of God, that ye may be able to stand against the wiles of the devil. For we wrestle not against flesh and blood, but against principalities, against powers, against the rulers of the darkness of this world, against spiritual wickedness in high places. Wherefore, take unto you the whole armor of God, 